Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're gonna talk about one of the best, if not the best, free video editing software for Windows 11. In this video, we're gonna talk about Video Proc Vlogger. This is a free video editing software that you can use in order to create all kinds of stuff. If you are a creative person, you can do whatever you want with this video editing software. And the most important thing, it is that this program is completely free. You have no watermark or anything else. In this video, we're gonna go through the main features and show you how you can use the software to create your videos, vlogs, tutorials, or whatever you're doing. So let's begin. First up, when you open the program, you will need to either create a new project or open an existing project. Considering that we open up this program for the first time, we're just going to create a new project and let's name our project first project. I'm going to leave the location as is the resolution full HD and you can set the frame rate to 60 frames per second. And now let's create the new project by clicking the new project button. As you can see, the software has a really nice interface. It comes by default in this dark theme, which I really like and I really love using these dark themes in the video editors that I use. And this is very good for the eyes if you're using video editing software a lot. It is really good to use a darker theme as it won't affect your eyes as much. Now let's add some media to our library and we're just going to double click on that section and go to my desktop and open this video and I'm going to drag and drop it to my timeline. As you can see, if you want to zoom in into your timeline, just use this scroll bar in the right side here and you can zoom in to your video. Of course, the simple edits, if you want to cut or split, just click on the split button and you split your video. It automatically attaches to the previous one and that's really good. To edit the speed of the video, click on the speed button and here you will be able to do a whole bunch of edits. For example, at the middle of the video, you can set it to be a at 2x and uh, you can do a lot of nice effects using these. So this can be really cool. Of course, you also have the crop tool that you can use to crop your image and uh, change its resolution or zoom in if you want. You have some motion settings and here you have a whole bunch of effects that you can apply to your video. By clicking on the color button, you have some color settings. You can also apply some templates or some settings that they already created and you can also manually change the settings you want this is a very very complex video editing software and because it's free i really love it you can click on apply to apply the settings that you've done you also have the option to record or do a voiceover through your video of course you will need to uh, select your audio device first you can also simply add text if you want and you have a lot of settings that you can apply to your text the colors, the fonts, the alignment, and so on and so forth. You also have an interesting option, which is the extractor or audio to text helper. As it says here, extract sound or speech from video to an audio file that can be converted to text. This is really, really useful. And up here in the video, you also have transitions that you can apply to your video. For example, let's apply the transition here. And as you can see, the transition was applied to our video. We also have titles. We can have certain types of text. We can use also subtitles. As you can see, this is really useful. And we also have certain effects that we can apply to our video. What is really cool about this software is that it also can support 4K video editing and also GPU hardware acceleration, which is really useful for those of you who edit a lot of videos. Down here, we have the timeline. As I've said at the beginning of the video, you can use the timeline to add certain audio effects, subtitles, and also you can add multiple tracks by clicking on the plus button and selecting the type of track that you want to add. As I've said, the editing process with this software is unlimited. You can do whatever you want to your video. The only limitation is your own imagination. I think this is a really good free editing software that you can use in Windows 11. The exporting process is really simple. Just click on export. And here you need to enter the file name, for example, video. Where do you want to save? I'm going to save it on my desktop. The format, the quality also, FPS and audio. I don't have audio in this video, but that is okay. And also it will use hardware acceleration for encoding. Let's click on start and start the rendering or exporting process. The folder where our file was exported automatically opens up. So let's see our video. As you can see, this is the video that we've created. Of course, a very fast video with some effects, some edits, and also we applied a text. So all the links necessary will be in the description down below where to download the software and also more information on how to use it. All the features explained step by step if you are a beginner in video editing. So don't forget to check out Video Proc Vlogger. 
This was the video for today. If it was useful, don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBased. Until next time, have a nice day.